case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1976, the United States Court of Claims heard the case of Boise Cascade Corp v. United States, which sought to recover $2.4 million in income taxes plus interest paid by Boise Cascade Corp. for the years 1955 through 1961. The dispute centered around the timing of income and expense items incurred by an accrual basis taxpayer, specifically Abasco Services' unearned income account. The plaintiffs argued that the commissioner's proposed accounting method did not accurately reflect Abasco's income and was not in accordance with generally accepted accounting principles. However, the court disagreed with the plaintiffs on certain issues, such as gains from original issue discount. In a similar case, General Foods Corporation v. United States, it was determined that gains attributable to original issue discount were taxable as ordinary income rather than short-term capital gains. Despite this, the court ultimately determined that Abasco's accounting method followed generally accepted principles and accurately reflected its income. The court treated accounting principles and income reflection separately, ruling that amounts accrued in Abasco's unearned income account were not taxable until services were performed. The court dismissed petitions on original issue discount and ruled in favor of plaintiffs with regards to the accounting issue, reserving the determination of the recovery amount for further proceedings. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.